Water in the well. What a farmer needs most for his fields is a good source of water. Kasim had his eye on a well that was just outside the boundary of his field. But Ahmed, the man who owned the well, was a crafty old man. He wouldn't allow anyone to draw water from his well. He told Kasim, Why do you come to me again and again to beg for access to my well? I feel sorry to turn down your request every time. I have a suggestion for you. Collect some money and buy the whole well from me. Kasim thought over the suggestion and liked it. He knew Ahmad would ask for a lot of money, but he saw in his mind's eye channels of water running from the well through his field and made a decision. He took all his savings to Ahmad and bought the well. The next day he went to the well happily and dug out a channel. But when he began to draw water, there was a surprise in store for him. Suddenly, Ahmed came forward and announced, What are you doing, Kasim? How dare you touch the water in my presence? What do you mean? Haven't you sold this well to me? Ah, I sold the well, all right, but not the water in the well. The water still belongs to me. You can't use it. If you needed the water along with the well, you should have said so. I have a suggestion for you. Pay for the water separately and use it. You can buy fresh water every day. I don't mind. Kasim was shocked to hear Ahmed's argument. It was so unfair, so unjust. He rushed to the Kazi and told him the whole story. The Kazi was a wise man. He told Kasim to bring Ahmed to his court so that he could hear both sides of the case. Ahmed was summoned to the court. The Kazi heard his argument patiently. Hmm, I see that you're right. What you have sold is the well. The water is all yours. Isn't that so? Kasim's heart sang when he heard the Kazi's words. Ahmed, in his heart of hearts, was overjoyed. He had never thought the Kazi would side with him. My Lord, I am so grateful you understand the fine points of this case. The water does indeed belong to me. In that case, Ahmed, why are you keeping it in Kasim's well? You have no right to keep your belongings in this property. You must remove them immediately or else you can pay a daily rent to Kasim. Then he will allow you to use his well. Ahmed was so confused that he did not know what to say. All the people present in the court began to laugh. But Kasim was a generous man. He never troubled Ahmed for the rent that was due from him.